to my channel. I know I just did a redecorating my room video, but we need to paint it because I haven't I haven't shown them it with the TV off yet. Oh. Basically, I had two TVs in my room. If you haven't watched part one, you need to go back and watch part one. That is very loud. Um, can you stop following me? It's too loud. I don't want to be able to hear anything. Um, but yeah, so basically, we redecorated my room and there's now two TVs because George brought one of his, which is on a stand. And my one doesn't have a stand. So we just took it off the wall and there's like holes in the wall. It's disgusting. It's not really painted very well. So we think we found my paint in the garage. It looks like it's my paint. It looks like a nice, like really light gray. So hopefully it's the same color. Cosmo is watching me. If it is the same color, absolutely brilliant. If not, then I don't quite know what we're gonna do, but yeah, this is part two of the transformation because I'm also gonna order some prints to make it look pretty. And that looks very gray to me. Right, I'm gonna. That looks very great to me. So all we're actually doing today, whoa, be careful, it's making sure it's the same color, which it is. No, you can't, don't paint more no. than that because we haven't washed the wall. Yeah, I'm just doing a basic, this is a underlying coat, just to. Ooh. Right, mum, if you're watching this, you know that wasn't me. I can't believe you've just done that without washing the wall. It's gonna be so bad. No, we're just Sweetheart. Gonna... Okay, so we've got a roller and a tray. There's no, sandpaper anywhere though, can't find any of it. So I'm just gonna clean out um, like the roller and stuff because it's obviously been in there for ages, which is kind of disgusting. But would you clean a roller with is what's confusing me. I couldn't tell you. Um, I've got warm water in here. It's not boiling, don't worry. It's not going to melt it. You need to clean it out. I assume you use soap. I really don't know. Um, but anyway, it's been out in the garage, so it's probably got like mud on it and stuff. And obviously I don't want mud transferring onto my wall, thanks. But yeah, no sandpaper, so I don't know how we're gonna sand down the room. Who knows? Um, the thing is, these have obviously got to dry as well. That's gonna take so long. Do I use washing up liquid? To wash it up, that would make sense, wouldn't it? Yeah, probably. Um, this isn't going to get done today, obviously, and George is leaving in a second. Um, but I just wanted to make sure I like had found the paint, which we have, which is a good start. And ooh, cleaned out of this, so it's literally ready to go. So then, as soon as obviously George painted the wall, that was not me. Um, so as soon as that's dry we will wash the wall down and then it will be ready for painting hopefully so that's the plan for today and then i do need to now i can order the prints so i'm basically getting some prints from this if, if you've heard of disenio it's not disenio it's poster store they're very very similar but they're like a little bit cheaper and they've got like a winter deal on at the moment so if the deal is still on which i really hope it is otherwise i've lost out on a lot of money then i'm gonna order those prints um i did a video on it about three years ago when i first redecorated my room so yeah go back and watch that one if you want to see what i'm talking about but all of my prints are very like beachy themed so i'm gonna order those obviously that will be later on in this video i think they said they come in like five days or something so it's not too bad at all um yeah this looks like it's cleaning a bit and again this is not boiling water don't worry but yeah that's the plan basically okay the paint has dried exactly the same color as the wall i mean obviously it's not completely dry yet it's been on for about 10 minutes but <clears throat> it's dried so that is good we've cleaned the wall a bit <clears throat> and um just gonna basically start painting soon Okay, I've just got changed into painting clothes. Can I just do it right in the middle? Yeah. I feel like I'm going to do it wrong. I feel like you're judging me. Not at all. No, you're dragging. You need to make sure it rolls. I don't think it has enough paint on it. Hey, hey my wall's going to be grey again. And yes, there are like a lot of holes in the wall. I can't really help that. They're not allowed to come out. He's been told, she's been told no. Because basically they would make a bigger hole. So it's not really worth it. Can you do it in the same direction? 
feel like it'll be streaky otherwise. But to be fair, they are kind of camouflage in. You, you can't really tell, to be honest, considering there's a whole TV there. I will, of course, have photos on this wall, so don't worry, it's not going to look um, disgusting. Love how he's just gone and done the whole thing. Will you take too long? And it's, it's got a dry. Called having a YouTube channel, my darling. Um, I'm, yeah, I'm happy, actually, because it's the same colour. Ah, oh, look at us completely redoing a room. But yeah, so that's what I redid in the first room. We put those prints up from the poster store, and I've got some very, very similar ones that I'm looking to get from also the poster store. I don't know why I got changed just to paint that tiny bit of wall. Um, but I've got six and that's how I've arranged them to look. Basically like that. So like tall. So they fit there. They all fit in there really nicely. So I'm just going to order them. Cool. Now I know that the wall's right. right. And yeah, they're going to look pretty good. I think that'll go there nicely, actually, because that'll cover all the holes. Yeah. So we've just done another coat of the wall. So it looks darker, but I assume it will dry. Um, and I've just stolen two hooks from downstairs because I'm going to put these inside my wardrobe. Because if you didn't know, I have a wardrobe like that where it basically like closes in, but you can't make the wardrobe any bigger or anything and I don't really have room for all my bags and stuff and I don't just want them out on display. So I'm gonna put these hooks on the inside bit of my wardrobe right, and then hand. they'll hook the bags. And we're just putting my mirror up there now because there's no room for it in my new room. <laughs> okay, um, quick change of plan, guys. So we've just done the last coat on that. And then I said to George, yeah, like I love my room, but I hate my bathroom. And I know that sounds like a little spoiled girl. Oh my God, I don't like my ensuite, but like, it's yellow it's yeah, actually yellow so i'm gonna paint it gray because also my shower's gray so it will like match nicely so i'm gonna do that myself today mum might well murder me but she can just do that because um i want to like my room so that's the plan Okay guys, so I'm just gonna do a little tour and just show you quickly what um, I have done to my room. Sorry, someone's just commented something on my photo. Um, anyway, so this is the wall that was painted, which has turned out really, really well. It's literally the exact same color, obviously, because it's the same paint. Um, obviously the screws are still in, but that doesn't really bother me because I'm getting two little photos to cover it. Or I was thinking, get a mirror that size then I can put some prints up the wall so I could put like I don't know two up the wall there one could definitely go under there because now it looks a bit bare and then I could definitely put one in the bathroom so I'm going to just turn on the bathroom light now so this is obviously my new bathroom it looks unreal those little marks aren't marks they are reflections from this I've never actually noticed them before but um yeah, please ignore the stains all down my jumper. That is so annoying. Anyway, so I've obviously painted the whole thing. The furniture's back in. I need to get a new, um, like, cabinet here because this doesn't close properly and this is, like, obviously disgusting. But I feel like that just comes with having it in the bathroom. Like, it's not going to be clean all the time, is it? Um, but obviously, I've done an all right job. This is two coats. I did get it on the ceiling a little bit up there, but it doesn't really bother me. And then these are my shelves, obviously a lot of stuff on them. I got half of this stuff for Christmas and I've just put it all up there because then I'll actually use it. Like if it's all up there, I'm more likely to use it. I've obviously painted around here around the toilet. Did an all right job. I've put all the furniture back in place, put the towels back, all of that. I did actually manage to paint behind there, which I was really quite shocked about. I didn't think I was going to be able to do that. 
I only did one coat behind there because it was really hard, but yeah, everything's back in situ and I bloody love it. So I will insert my brother's reaction. He didn't even notice. And then I said to my mum, I was like, come upstairs, like you have to look at my new room. She came up and she was like, well, no, I didn't say that. I didn't say anything about a room. Um, I just said, come upstairs. And then she came into my bathroom and went, oh my God, you have so many perfumes. And I was like, yeah, I do, but like, can you not notice the difference? Um, and she was like, what difference? And it took her a while, but I was like, mum, the walls are grey. And she was like, oh, you painted them. Like, why did no one realise that my walls weren't grey? It's so weird, but, but it was quite a big deal to me. But obviously, no one else really cared. Um, but yeah, so now I have everything here. I'm just more likely to use it because it's all out on the side. So I'm actually going to use a bit of body lotion now because I'm about to get into bed. So I'm just going to do like a little wind down kind of thing. Like, you know, I know I'm basically in pyjamas, but get into my actual pyjamas that I'm going to be sleeping in, do a little bit of a self-care routine. So... Yeah, I love my new bathroom. Just honestly, it's crazy the difference a colour makes. It just feels so clean. Obviously, I had a, like something up there and I had some things on the walls and this just looks so much cleaner and I just love it. So I was thinking maybe prints could go up there, but I'm not sure in a bathroom if that's really a good idea. So yeah, I might just leave it like this, but I'm obsessed. So basically the next plan is wait for the prints to come, um, which will go here. And I w if I do find the perfect mirror, then I might buy it, um, just like a little one to go there, even if it's like, probably like a square, so probably about 70 by 70, maybe that's a bit big, maybe a long thin one actually, like um, all the way along there. I don't know, we'll see, but I'm not sure yet. If you have any suggestions, I don't know, I'll have already decided by the time this video goes out, but yeah i don't know but i have obviously ordered the prints so i would like to do something with them um i don't just want to send them straight back it feels like a bit of a waste of time and money well actually no not a waste of money i'd actually be obviously saving money by sending them back just don't really want to send them back um I need to find a good mirror otherwise because i do like the idea of having a mirror i feel like it would open it up a little bit What can you not notice? What can I have a little Is there a TV in the bathroom? Why are you filming me? Because I thought you were going to have a better reaction from it. what? I painted the walls. I painted my entire bathroom grey. It was yellow. Are you serious? It was always grey. I swear if mum doesn't notice. I literally did this today. It doesn't smell like wet paint. I literally did it today. It's not wet. Yeah. Wow. Right, we've taken down what was there and we're going to put up new ones. Let's make this more homely. I feel like I don't have enough wall space, but I do have this wall. We'll see. okay guys so let me show you what i've done so far so my mum was helping me before and she's not a big fan of the camera so i wasn't filming but obviously this is part two of renovating renovating that's not the right word is it like sprucing up my room to make it look like a pinterest board because that's my vibe and to be quite honest, I hated my room before. Step one was like moving it all around, as you guys saw. Step two, putting the pictures up, making it look pretty. Obviously, I already had loads of pictures on my wall, but I'm going to show you what I've added. So for my birthday, my 16th, I asked for these photos. And now, no, sorry, 18th, 18, 17th, I asked for these photos. 20th, I asked for some more. Um, So I put these ones up. They're both new. You might be thinking, why do you need so many pictures on a wall? But like... I think it's so cute. It just, it brings me happiness. Like, it gives me somewhere to be in life. Like, Venice, I'd love to go. Amalfi Coast, get me there. Another Venice. A turtle, my favourite animal in the whole world. Is that Amalfi Coast again? Yes, it is. Um, another Venice. Can you tell where I want to go? Italy! And then they're, like, gorgeous, gorgeous beaches. I'm saying Australia. That's how I'm putting these. Then um, I've just put these ones up with the help of my mum. So if you didn't know, I did get this mirror from uh, Dunelm. I want to say and 
yeah, I put it portrait. I was going to put it landscape, but this just works better for me. Um, and I've got these pictures above it. Basically, the reason above, reason why they're above is because I use this a lot for filming and stuff. And some brands would only want like plain, if that makes sense. And I feel like that's quite like cluttered. So they're above, which does look really cute. Like if you're standing back here, like, oh, cute. I love it There's so much. So I was going to put them over there. But then I thought if I ever get like a shelf or something, they'd just be right in the way. So I love that very much. And yeah, that's all I've added so far. Now, let me show you which pictures I have left. So um, I asked, this, these are all for my 20th. So sorry, I'm uploading stuff to YouTube and that needs to not turn off. Okay, then I got this one. This print is just, I love it. Probably already read this, but let me read it again. Balance is key in everything you do. Dance all night long and practice yoga the next day. Drink wine, but don't forget your green juice. Eat chocolate when your heart wants it and kale salad when your body needs it. Wear high heels on Saturday and walk barefoot on Sunday. Go shopping at the mall and then sit down and meditate in your bedroom. Live high and low, move and stay still. Embrace all sides of who you are and live your authentic truth. Be brave and bold and spontaneous and loud and let that complement your abilities to find silence and patience and modesty and peace. Aim for balance. Make your own rules and don't let anybody tell you how to live according to theirs. And it makes me want to get the word balance tattooed on me. That's how much I love it. But one of my friends like closest friends who I see a lot wants that as her first tattoo so there's no way I'm gonna like take that from her but I want the word balance here I just love that but I feel like that would be a bit bitchy of me <laughs> um and then I've also got the Trevi fountain I was gonna print off the photo that I took of the Trevi fountain but this one just matched so well with all of the other prints in my room so I got this one by the way these are all from poster store um they're kind of like Desenio vibes, but like cheaper. Um, yeah, so this is going to go on that wall up there somewhere. I think this balanced one is going to go in my bathroom. I mean, it could go there, but then there's nothing the other side. So it's a bit odd. I think that would look a bit funny. It's a shame there's not two portrait ones, to be honest. Um, there's not. Um, and then, so two of these I did already have. Let me just show you guys. So these are little, little ones. So I've got palm trees, tan skin, sunsets, coconuts, hot nights, salty air. Name everything I love. Feelings are much like waves. We can't stop them from coming, but we can choose which ones to surf. Bloody brilliant. And then this is the new one I got. Um, life is not always perfect, but it's always what you make it. So make it count, make it memorable, and never let anyone steal your happiness. And... I just freaking love all three of them. They're just so happy and cute and positive and just my vibe. So, I don't know where to put you guys, actually. Where can I put you? Can I balance you up here or are you just going to fall? If you fall, you break my TV, so. Okay, I've got to not make any sudden movements. I'm thinking of putting them here. Do you see the vision? Like one two three okay one two three cute uh, is that cute i think that's cute yeah that's what i'm gonna do so i'm gonna try to do this now Wish me luck. Can't let you fall. I think first I'm going to put the Trevi Fountain one up. So I'll put you guys there. So I need to put some command strips on these because we don't use like nails and things. We use command strips. Um, so, oh gosh, didn't mean to do that. Uh, we do, well, I do need to cut it in half because the frame is so like thin that these are too thick. I think these are just from Amazon, by the way. But they're quite cool, because you can like take them off and change them around and everything. Ah. Okay. Oh, I don't know if this is gonna look... Oh. That's wonky. That one's wonky, isn't it? I think it's wonky. Hmm. I don't know. 
looking in the camera, it looks kind of wonky. I'll blame my mum for that one. <laughs> um, okay, so, got the command strips on. Let's make sure they're really on. I need the level as well, let me grab that. Mm -hmm. Such a tiny little thing, they do a good job, okay. Let's see. I'm thinking this gap rather than that gap. Although I feel like I need to kind of do both, but I can't, so. Um, uh, like that. Does that look good? Do I, uh, is that centered? Is it level? Mm. Uh oh. It's on the wall. I think. Shit. Ah! Come on up, you get. I don't know how to see if this is level because the level, I can't actually see it. Okay. okay. Whoa! Shit, I've lost it. I mean, it's level, but I lost the level. That's really, really shit. It's down the back of my bed. My mum's gonna kill me. Well, I guess mission, let's find this level. is commencing. Um, don't quite know how to do this. I don't know what to do. I need to move the bed. Oh, oh my God, it weighs a ton. How am I meant to just pull the bed out? Oh my gosh. I don't actually know what I'm doing. Right, I think I have a solution. I've got my brother's lightsaber. It doesn't turn on. <gasps> if he knew I was using this, I think he'd kill me. Sure. I don't think this is even his, um... Um, how do you turn it off? Shit! He's gonna know I've used it. Because I can't turn it off. Shit! Well, I'm gonna go looking for the thing with this lightsaber. Guys, no, it nearly went under my bed. I'm so close. I've lost it because it's under my bed. Right, I managed to turn off the lightsaber, which means he never has to know. I'm going to try the coat hanger. Okay, I've just put these up on the wall. Um, I've got the Life's Not Always Perfect palm trees and then the Feelings Are Much Like Waves. I think that looks cute. Um, I like... Picasso, there's room for one more at the top and one more at the bottom if I fancied it. Um, and then I've put, oh no, I've already shown you guys those ones. Then I put the final one there and hate the positioning. I want it down here, but it's a bit freaking late, isn't it? Because um, it's stuck on the wall. So that's that. Then obviously there's those two new ones. And yeah, that's my new room, basically. So as you guys have seen through both of these videos, I've literally completely transformed it. I painted the whole bathroom, put up a load of prints, moved around the whole room. Pretty obsessed. Love it all. Oh, and in the midst of that, George also got me this little fake like Lego flower thing. Um, so I have flowers all year round. Cute.
love it um so yeah we've got a nicely decorated room now there's loads and loads of lovely prints and yeah i'm very happy about it so thank you all so much for watching this video i hope you have enjoyed if you did give it a thumbs up subscribe and i'll see you in my next one adios